Another day goes by, and yet we still wait for that settlement for XRP, but time waits for no man or woman. There is another big partnership coming to the forefront for XRP and Ripple. I'm going to break down exactly what's going on, why it's so important, and furthermore, the expectation around this settlement. All of that in this video, so make sure you hit that like and subscribe button, and let's dive straight into it. So as always, let's take a quick look at the market, but welcome back to the channel. Bitcoin, 62,900. Looks like at the point of recording this video, we may retest $63,000. What a difference 24 hours makes. And the same could be said for XRP, up about 0.19% on the day. Everybody's still waiting for that settlement announcement. And for me, this is an absolute true sentiment that XRP will explode if the settlement is in the favor of XRP. Ripple, we expect it to be that case. You can see just under a billion dollars in volume. People are not buying in droves. Now, sensible people, in my opinion, are picking up some of these bags as when we know the outcome from the settlement of the SEC, expect a big price movement. Now, if it goes the other way and the SEC win, then maybe not so much, but we do expect a big price movement. And I think for me, even Ripple expect a pretty big price movement. And that's why they continue to build these huge partnerships they ultimately try and strive to be that custodian of financial movements and cross-border payments in the global sector this bull run and further on beyond that. So what's going on? What is the big partnerships? Well, it's a very interesting point and ultimately a big, big announcement. So Ripple and XRPL Labs recently joined forces with the Swirls Labs, developer of blockchain network Hedera and the Algorand Foundation to become members of the Decentralized Recovery Alliance. Now, again, you will have definitely heard of some of these constellation network, the Hashgraph Association, HBAR Foundation, Revive Labs, and many others, including the Building Blocks, Blade Labs, Bank Social, and tons more. Now, these are all part of a recovery alliance, the DREC Recovery Alliance. So ultimately, the alliance aims to accelerate the recovery of lost digital assets by providing an open source process, ensuring that investors institutions, whoever it is, can and should have access to lost digital assets and going forward, how they then get them back. Ultimately, this has been going around now since January of this year, with founding members providing feedback on the Alliance policies and governance structure and receive a two-year seat on the Technical Oversight Committee. Ultimately, though, Westy Wind, founder of CEO of XRP Lab, says, as we move towards individual adoption, it is increasingly clear that advanced yet user-friendly solutions for key recovery are required. DREC Alliance is committed to improving interoperability and improving security, and it came a critical moment bringing together experts to simplify the user experience without compromise. Now, if you remember, I talked about XRPL and the fact that it had a recovery notion. They could ultimately recall a transaction put through that blockchain, which is absolutely the right thing for institutions, banking sectors. What we don't want to see is huge amounts of money coming out of those people going into the wrong hands. So they already implemented the ability to recall that transaction on the XRPL. This, for me, is another development, bringing a further use case to both XRPL and, more importantly, XRP, the native token. The fact that we're linked in with such projects as H uh, Hedera and, again, the Algorand Foundation is a massive move for XRP. Linked into all of the other fiat-based companies, Metico, Bank of America, HSBC, and all those we talked about yesterday, it's a pretty big deal. One of those other ones that go underneath the radar that not a lot of people seem to be talking about, but is going to play such a critical role going forward for both Ripple Labs and more importantly, the build out on XRPL, when you start talking about token implementation, NFTs, and much more, then it is absolutely critical that some of these parts are to play on there. When you bring users and you bring volume and ultimately you scale, you have to have a point of difference. And I think that's where XRPL is absolutely trying to set itself. And that is why XRP is becoming the most discussed asset on the market. And ultimately, among community uh, signal groups and as among just kind of everyday life, XRP has been talked about every single day, even here on YouTube. And we actually know that views for cryptocurrency is down on YouTube. So if I could ask you guys, hit the like button, subscribe, interact with this video. It does massively help out the algorithm on this video, pushes this uh, video up to the top. But we know that views generally are down, but XRP still being one of the big ones to be talked about. People absolutely eagerly anticipating the settlement because it's such a pivotal moment 
for not only just Ripple and XRP, but the wider cryptocurrency and market itself. And it would set a precedent again with some of these Robinhood suings, Coinbase, Uniswap, and all of these others could fall like a house of cards if that settlement is in the favor of XRP. And I do believe that to be the case. So what's going on with the price right now? We are in a very small uptrend. And actually, our MACD is continuing now from April 23rd in a nice upward trend. It might not feel like it, but it absolutely is. Some key points we want to get back to is around here, though. 200 exponential moving average, 50-day simple moving average is bearish, but the trend is of an upside. So the next kind of three or four days would be critical. And we want to see this kind of come in, retest this cross with a then potential move furthermore to the upside. RSI is in our favor, as is the general market sentiment. Looks like Bitcoin is about to take 63,000 at the time of recording this video. So lots of positive news, lots of big partnerships, further build outs for XRP. I recall and talked about this yesterday that I believe XRP is like a coiled spring right now. And the minute that settlement comes in, it is going to explode as long as it's in the favor of Ripple. But as always, let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. And like I said, interact with this video, drop a comment. Let me know your views on everything. It really, really does help out the channel. It massively helps out this video. And ultimately, I'd love to hear what you guys think of all of this. But before you go, make sure you hit that subscribe button and don't forget to turn your notification bell on and click all so you don't miss an upload or a live stream. And as always, thank you so much for watching the video and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.